Hey, turn that shit up, man. <laughs> hey, turn that shit up, man. Okay. Yeah. Ah, uh, shit. Drilling number. It's your boy, Young 360. Not only no other shit. Yeah, what's I'm good? Scared, man. Man. Let's take a bet, man. You might, you might. You attached it. Bet like I never done. Because the plan right now. What another video, man. It just started. Man. Guess what, man? Today, uh -huh. today, today. Today. Hello, bro. Hello, bro. Today. P. P. Today. Yeah, I know what we doing, man. Like, come on, like. P. We don't know by now, man. Listen, come on. Fix this shit. You don't know we doing about now, man. Let me stand up. Got that shit on. Sound the same. So, uh, you understand what I'm saying? Hold on, man. I'll let you see that shit right there. Hey, and the signature coming soon. You feel me? Oh, I'm trying to make it. And I got some more jerseys. Thank you. What about you, Lou? I'm pushing that top. Right, really right. should push Buddy now. Oh shit, yeah, you need to because the show kind of on. Yeah, yeah. it's that team that was on us over there. Hey, uh, tell me when you about to push A. Ain't no way he pushed. You said what? I said, tell me when you about to push A. I got to press that over here. EA Sports. I turned all the audio for this off. I don't know why this is still playing. Right now. Damn it. Only thing that lean is your beer when I bend over sipping Polish Springs in Arizona, man. Fuck that Coca Cola. You push A school? Yep. Alright, man. Is that Juliet? Okay, that's cool. I'm a Romeo. -er. You think you a demon? Until I G. Like I'm Tomioka. Man. Hold on, Scooter, you got me fucking stuck. You say what? EA got me stuck searching. Hey, bars, he pushing you. Hey, hold on, I about to say, Scooter, can you bag out and click A again? Yeah, I did that. Yes, sir, we lit, man. They didn't even add our. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Did they add the new jersey? No, they didn't. God damn it. I thought they added the new jerseys, but it's cool. We should have thrown that all red. Yeah. You ain't gonna lie. It's looking dangerous for you boys. <laughs> we in that all red. I'm talking about. I'm talking about this shit like Jason when we talk about, about that goddamn, goddamn cut, boy. This shit is a scary sight. sight. Oh, my bad. <laughs> He's straight. Bruh. This shit is a scary <laughs> sight. So like... Welcome, everybody, to Pasadena and the majestic Rose Bowl. Oh, a yeah. unique Rose setting Bowl, in all the sport. Man. This year's Rose Bowl, presented by Prudential, is a crucial Rose part Rose. of the college football playoff. We've reached the semi-final stage. One last hurdle to clear before that national championship game. And today we're going to find out who's got the toughest what? and the depth to continue their drive to keep championship dreams alive. As we'll yeah, see the first seed in this playoff, the Arkansas State Red Wolves. We'll see. Taking on I ain't played this in the minimum. The, playoff, the Appalachian State Mountaineers. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler. Joined by Kirk Herbstreit. And here we go. A college football playoff semi-final. Which team will keep their national championship hopes alive today?
from his end zone. Oh! 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 oh. Is it a big thing? The 40? The, the 30? The, the 20? Oh my race. goodness gracious! Hello! Yes! Oh! 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 And the BAT makes it 7-0. This is definitely already on that bullshit. This pickoff team, let's see if they give the returner an opportunity to bring this back. He's got it inside the 15. And he's top of at the 20. We're getting top of the 15, and we're going to keep that whole bit like that open. Shut up. Call coming up. How aggressive will it be? Quarterback making some changes at the line. Looking downfield, it's Wilson. Throws it to the right. Bro, come on, man. Block. Break the pass up. But well, his defense has been incredible all year long, and they continue to be that God, way postseason. Yeah. Just getting after this offense, whether it's putting pressure on the quarterback, great coverage Ooh. downfield. Right now, they are dominating. Oh, and he's in the clear now. It's a foot race. It's good enough for first down yardage. Well, they finally corralled him, but he was untouched on the scrimmage for his burst to a big crease. I'm going crazy on my defense. Like you said, this guy was untouched. I don't know how they were able to finally catch up to him and bring him down, but just no excuses at all from the defense after a play like that. Made the catch, but he was surrounded for not much room to run. They did a really good job that time of leveraging him out in space. I, I thought he might have a chance to be able to shake loose because he is so elusive. But uh, defense, no, said, did a really good job. In Touchdown, Mountaineers. Strong game by this quarterback. This guy can do it all. We've seen him go behind coverage and make plays downfield. We can see him catch the ball underneath just like this. When he catches a football, he is so dangerous after the catch. This one leads him into the end zone for the six points. And they tack on the extra point. <laughs> now they get set to kick it away. Plus, I threw it as soon as he broke. And he's going to bring this out from a couple yards deep in the end zone. He'll be tackled at the 18. That's good coverage there. Looking to throw. Wow, taking his shot on the very That's first it. play. The pass is dropped. It would have been a big game, but he couldn't so big, bro. You get a tight end like this, and you know he's used to dishing out the punishment, but here, he's the one that has to absorb the contact, and as a result, he's unable to hold on to the football. So, second down after the incompletion. Thrown quickly, caught in the right flat. Breaks loose at the 45. They bring him down, but not before an explosive play through this offense through the air. Well, it's one thing to hear about how fast this receiver is in the scouting report. You look at him on film all week. The defense coordinator tells you, get ready, this guy can run. And then the reality comes. And this guy can fly. You see it again here. Nice catch. Comes a first down pass attempt. With the catch, it's Chambers. And he shut that amount with the defense short of the first down marker. Boy, a really good job up front here by the offensive line, giving the quarterback plenty of time for that route to clear underneath before he made the throw. That completion makes it second and medium. Quick throw caught on the left side. 
Tackle is finally made, but an explosive gain. They'll move it down to the 23-yard line. And the Red Wolves come up to the line in the area. I love how this quarterback is finding this slot receiver. Not only is he tough to handle, but it's what he's doing after the catch. He has such wiggle and quickness. He's tough to bring down. You see more positive yards after the catch here. The Red Wolves are in the red zone now. He should have owned it that way. Bro, I see it. He shouldn't even done that. Nigga ain't slide, man. Nigga actually slid into a fumble. First and goal, they'll try to run it in. But we already, bro, we already knew the running was coming, man. Example, right? so you put the running back back there, but you don't need to do that. You know what we've done, man? Sorry, yeah, it's over on me, bro. That's okay, yeah, we need to that shit. Oop, got it bad. Looks to the left, and it's complete. A tackle made after a solid game. He spot the ball at the 34. Nah, bitch, I broke that. Yeah, I offense. saw you. You got your ass broke. Takes the handoff. It's Roberts. He shreds the tackle. Good for him. Chris, I just love to see this offensive line in this running game able to establish themselves. This back is already over 50 yards in the first half. So really good job of establishing the run game. Opens up the play action. Opens up one-on-one -on -one opportunities. Just keep winning the back. Looking to throw it deep. Bro, see, I forgot, man. This quarterback is fucking so deep. Big takeaway. Now looking for a big return. Finally, it will take him down, but that's a great return after the pick. Like, bro, if he throw me the choice words for his quarterback on the phone on the sideline after that throw. You have to be more careful with the football. The Arkansas State offense back on the field now. They punch it in the last possession. Can they do it again? Or will this defense make some adjustments to get a stop? Incomplete. They cannot connect on the deep ball. That ball just seemed to sail on. You gotta make sure to give your receiver a chance to be able to come down with a catch and bounce because in today's game, man, these receivers make catches like this all the time. And if you put the ball out of bounds, you're not gonna give them that opportunity. Throwing again on second and ten. He'll take a deep shot. What the fuck is he doing? Touchdown, Arkansas State. Just ran away from the defense. Well, that's a well machine. That should never make sense. Everyone on this offense has been a star in their roles. When they're rolling like this, it results in quick and positive results. With the extra point, the lead is 14. The kickoff team has come on the field now to send this one away. The quarterback can fucking throw it, shit. Shit, okay. He's going to return it from deep in the end zone. Yeah. Yeah. At the 13, not great field position to start the drive. Yeah. The App State offense goes back on the field. And this offense trying to bounce back the last possession and then in a pick. Grab behind the line, it's Tucker. In the clear at the 25. They bring him down, but that is a huge play for this passing game. The big game. One play moves the ball to the 44 and be first down. 
Boy, nice job here by this offense, creating an opportunity for this receiver to accept. Bro, look at this shit, bro. I can't do this. Bro, I swear to God. That's why I can't do this app state shit no more. You can just act like you can throw. You can do that shit all season. This nigga. Like, bro, I ain't had that problem with Billy Aguilar throwing that bitch. This nigga, though. I don't know what the fuck. escapes the pocket and takes off. <laughs> He's gonna take off. Breaks loose at the 40. Heads out of bounds after a solid game. More than enough to go first down. Boy, this guy can do it all. We know what he can do with his arm, but when things aren't there, does a good job of pulling it down, knowing where the first down marker is, picking up the first down. Offense comes up to the line. He might have a chance for a couple more plays before the quarter expires. The DB's backing off from the line now. The RPO caught to the right. The defense able to bring him down to wrap up the first period of play. So here we go, first play of the quarter. The offense has a first down. Here's the handoff. They make the tackle, but that's an excellent game. Moves the ball to the 33. Nothing better than an offense on first down. Be able to pick up big, positive yards like that. You can either keep giving it to the back, or it can set up play action and get the defense to come up to the line of scrimmage, and you can throw it over top of Secondary backed up off the ball now. DB is looking to jam the receivers at the snap. Looking to throw it on first down. No. Missed his receiver. Oh, so my God. That's a misfire there, Chris. This passing game is going to be able to get in the sink and find the rhythm. So after the incompletion, it's second down. Hands it off from the gun. Quick spin on the run. And that run produces a decent game. The Red Wolves will hustle to the line here to run the hurry up. To throw, it's Rainer. He's got it. Bro, look at this. Defense makes the saving tackle at the three. And the Red Wolves hoping to punch it in here. They have first and goal. And now a timeout quickly called by the defense as they try to get everybody on the same page here. The offense sets up in scoring position with a new set of downs. They'll try to run this one in. And he runs it into the end zone. Touchdown, Red Wolves. I think we're starting to kind of see a theme here, Chris, today. That's his second touchdown. The offensive line doing their job, and he's doing an outstanding job of just reading the defense, finding the hole, and being able to pick up big yards and touchdowns. Point after, not right through. Kickoff team on the field getting set now. This one is not returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone. Set up. It's a first down play. And there's the handoff. The game moves the ball to a third Second down after that run on the previous play. Quarterback drops back. You're going to test the secondary. Looks so like he's going to run it. So that down he went out of bounds, but not before picking up enough for a first down. Fresh set it down to the offense. First down. Quarterback drops back from the shotgun. Fires it to the wideout. There's a wide open receiver complete. Big play in enemy territory. All the way to the 41 yard line. Offense operating at high tempo now. No huddle. Looking for some space. It's Roberts. 
He'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. Boy, how about that play? Because that thing just opened up the back shot through there with great acceleration. What a pickup there on first down. Looking to throw. It's Wilson. Pressure is coming. He's taken down behind the line. He's going to lose a yard or two. This is good pressure by the defense. It just felt like the quarterback was holding on to the ball a little bit too long, which allowed the defense to get home. Quarterback wants to throw it on second down. Fires it on the move. Is that he pulls it in for a big game. Bro. And a big game before he goes Bro. out of bounds. The offense keeps showing. Gets a fresh set of downs. He got it. Hold on here a second. The replay booth has signaled they want to take another look at this one. <laughs> Looks like they got the ruling on the field right the first time. They confirm it with the review. New set of downs for the offense. First and ten. He'll try to pick up the yardage on the ground. Ball carrier brought down at the four. Offensive great scoring position here. So here comes second down now. Every play important down here in the red zone. Quarterback looking to connect with the receiver here. Under pressure, just lets it go. And the pass is just thrown away. Clearly intentional grounding. And here comes the penalty mark. Seventh play of the drive coming up, but it is third down and long. Quarterback making adjustments down to what the defense is showing. They're going to throw it on third and very long. I was long. right. I was He's there. Touchdown. Oh, now. Oh, I, I played that shit too. Oh, so so I'm so trying to just hang in this game right now. And I love that they're not giving up. They are continuing to fight. That's really, that's really not even who I wanted to throw it to. Look at the right side of the field. It's wide for good. Still a two touchdown deficit, 28-14. Literally, the, the, the motherfucking tight end that did that the real route was wide. Field, okay. I seen the ball go through the middle of the field. I was like, fuck. And then I seen he was kind of open. I was like, that's Fields a window. Just outside the goal line. The coverage team brings it down at the 26. Bullshit. and 10 they'll look to throw it that's real in. it's Brian he's found some room at the 45 it's a big game before he goes out of bounds it'll move the sticks more than enough for a first down one play already to the 46 yard line it'll be first down from the shotgun now here's an inside give they bring him down, but that's a solid gain on the play. The Red Wolves will hustle to the line to crank the tempo. To the air, it's Rayner. Defense is coming after him. It's incomplete. He was hit as he threw a good pass rush there on the first down. Everybody talks about sacks, and they're very important. But sometimes just the rush, the pressure affecting the quarterback is just as effective. He didn't have a clean throwing lane, and they forced the incompletion. Puck on the line. It's Chambers. And the defense swarms not much of a gain on that completion. Well, any time an offensive coordinator calls a wide receiver screen, he's trying to get offensive linemen out in front of the receiver to create a wall so that receiver can pick a lane to run through. How about the defense here, though? That's called team pursuit, the swarming to the football. They didn't give him any lanes, so not much yards downfield for the receiver. Takes the football inside the Another positive game for this offense, and this quarterback continues to show how dangerous he is when he has time to throw. The defensive coordinator's got to change up his looks, maybe bring in the blitz, anything they can do to get this quarterback out of this rhythm. Trying to extend the play. You're going to pull down and run. And the runner scoots out of bounds after gaining the At least you need a throw well, this is why this guy's looked at as one of the top dual threat quarterbacks in the country. He can throw it, he can spin it downfield, but also he's a threat to be able to take off and go, just like 
like this, it puts so much pressure on this defense. And the Red Wolves are in the red zone. to throw. It's Rainer. He's got it near the end zone. The defense makes the stop at the three. Second down and goal upcoming. Fuck no. No, this should be good save, dude. This shit don't even make sense. Nigga hits to this nigga three different niggas and they all just give him an animation to tap this nigga four inside. They convert the PATs and the lead is now 21. So it has three touchdowns just before halftime. Not much time for the opposing offense to try to answer before the break. Gonna bring it out of the end zone from a couple yards deep. Look, he's brought down at the 12. That's a poor field position to start the drive. Just time enough for one more play in the half. Quarterback adjusting now to the defense. And looking to throw now on first down. Let's it fly out of the wideout. The Met falls incomplete as time runs out in the first half of play. And that will do it for the first half here. Kevin Connor now has our halftime update. <coughs> the Red Wolves will kick this away to get the second half going. And the return starts just inside the end zone. And he stopped with the 18. Returner tried to make a play, but a touchback would have been a better idea. So the Appalachian State offense back out on the field now. First play of the drive, they come out throwing. Looking for his big tight end. It's intercepted. Tried to fire it into a tight window. Tackled after a short There's no way, Nice play by this defense. Boy, this defense has been great the entire football game here. They knew they had a lot of pressure on them in the playoff. They stepped up and played well all game long, and now they get a critical interception here late in this game. Now the offense is set up with a short field. Inside give now from the shotgun. Let's stop that with Defense gets him down, but they'll take the gain on that play. I think this defense keeps thinking about them throwing the football, and by doing that, they're opening up running lanes. Good positive yards there by the running back. The offense now operating in the red zone. Looking to throw. It's Rayner. Fires it to the wide end. Bro, there's no way. They stopped him just short, but defense. Look, they have their meat now. I would drop the fuck out there. The Red Bulls will hustle to the line to run the hurry up offense. First in goal, handoff. Touchdown, Red Bulls. Dre, you think I'm finna keep playing this dumb ass shit? It's an easy job for the play caller, right? Dre, bro, this shit is cheating like a hoe, bro, once again. I'm gonna get into this game really thinking we'd see more from this girl. There's no way this nigga is getting up the field every fucking drive, bro. Or some dumb shit, bro. Damn, my quarterback act like he can't throw the fucking ball. He ain't got no arm strength or something. Pickup team is 
on the field. Let's see if they give the returner a chance to bring this one back. Ah, uh, bro, this nigga just ass. Fielded in the end zone. It's Alexander. And they start him short of the 25 there. Offense begins in the 22. Hey, bro. We'll see how this quarterback responds. Remember an interception of the very first play. Come on, see quarterback can bounce back. Quarterback is ass. Breaking free at the 35. Breaks clear. End zone ahead. At the 20. Bro. He runs it into the score. Touchdown, half state. Oh, my. What a great play call here by the offensive coordinator. They fall the fuck out of there. Walking up front and just took off with it. Carving up his defense all the way into the end zone. Kick is good. Oh, this shit is insane, bro. Flags all over the field. And the head coach will decide to accept the penalty and take the yardage. Team bro, I don't even know how the fuck you just did that anyway, bro. That's a deep kickoff. I'm talking about how this nigga just stiff on and got the fuck up out that hole like that. But still, bro, this game is ass. First down play call. How aggressive will it be? Off. Bro, are you serious? Bro, 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 bro. The senior able to make the stop after a short game. Now it's second down here. Back to throw. It's Rayner. Looking for his big tight end. Finds a man open on the right side downfield. They finally make the tackle, but the I know I should have stayed on that nigga, but I ain't think he's gonna have time to go seven. What a pitch and catch by the quarterback and receiver for a big gain for this offense. The offense is clicking and the defense just searching for answers now. Yo. The tight end goes in motion before the snap. And my bad, bro. College football was all on day, so shit. I just just finished watching Georgia, bro. They almost they almost lost the fucking Kentucky, bro. They got behind coverage. Looked like a big play, if not a touchdown. They dropped the ball. Exactly. They're second down. Wait, who did who did South Carolina play with? LSU. Nah, both, I ain't gonna lie, both down, to throw it again. But to be honest though, Georgia kind of Georgia kind of ass too. But I ain't I ain't saying Kentucky ass. Third down is a handoff. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. The offense will go for it here on fourth down and three. Off the play fake, looking to throw the football. Contact is bro, going. come on, man. This nigga got He's hit, bro. They still let him go. They got him, but he until he makes the first out of his drive. He's going. They want well, Chris, here's an example of what we always talk about. On fourth down, the receiver's got to run a route beyond the snaps. Oh, awareness to know exactly where he is. Quarterback makes the throw. Receiver gets hit, but he's beyond the sticks for the first down. Quick throw to his receiver. Oh, oh my nice God. Throw. The defender got a hand in there to break up the pass. Some players just have a real knack for timing their jump, and that defender was able to get a big paw on the ball. Oh, damn, they're paid that motherfucker. Lines up for a second down play off the incompletion. Go to Dynasty. I'm finna go see who the fuck I play real fast. I think I play Georgia. Yep. You sure do, buddy. Wait, do I play Georgia or have I beat Georgia already? No, I beat them niggas. I beat them already. Yeah, I beat them niggas 63 to 56. Hey, you saying you saying UAB almost beat Arkansas? The defense is in position and they tackle him for a loss. 
I'm dead ass. Off play action, he's looking to throw. I'm dead ass. <laughs> the receiver makes the grab. The the Razorbacks the almost got dead. Almost got dead. Kill my best friend. Hey, shit, you see Arkansas State got dead ass from today too. Ready I forgot who the fuck did they lose to. They've had that. Now they're everybody. It was like some. It was some big. It was, I ain't gonna lie. It was a big thing. They do their job. Them niggas lose to everybody. Now they keep working that clock and getting so much closer. Nah. The they oh round. they play fucking oh, Michigan. Up on first but Michigan ass. So like, honestly, that don't count for Michigan. That really don't count. Them niggas just got their ass whooped on last week. But see if they had, you know yeah, what I'm saying? It's Rainer. Yes. You know, <laughs> if, if they had had my man's, bro, niggas would have been, you know what I'm saying? Word. Coach Beckham, you get the sense that this offense wanted a little bit of more. Ah, man. You feel me? If, if UAB had, you know what I'm saying, Coach Payne up there, I'm trying to stay. And the route is on. Jacob Zeno, man, he would have been for 500. Bro, it's so crazy. I was, uh, I got down here, drove up to the school at UAB. My sister go there and shit. And goddamn, I walked in the motherfucking student center. But tell me why I seen that nigga Amir Thomas and that bitch just chilling, bro. I was like, bro, that's, that's crazy, bro. Nah, the fucking uh, the wide receiver from the fucking UAB. I, I was like, damn, bro. You know you got them. You was my second uh, you was my second motherfucking re uh receiver leader on the team, my nigga. That shit crazy, bro. I need, I need. The Appalachian State offense back out on the field now. It didn't take long to reach the end zone last time. Nah, bro. He, was like, he was like, he was like, shit, everybody be saying this shit, though. He was like, shit. Well, I, he was like, I'm the guy. He was like, he the damn receiver down, leader for the fucking on Dynasty. He was like, shit. I'm going to leave, though. No I ain't gonna lie, bro. That nigga Jacob Zeno, he's he fast as fuck in real life. They got that nigga slow as hell. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> so what? We get drunk. So what? We smoke. We Hey, y'all, y'all playing y'all game? What the hell? Keeping the offense on the field inside his own thirty. Oh shit! Quick throw over the middle. Finds his receiver. That's enough for the first down. They got Old Dominion and fucking North Carolina and Birmingham, bro. Last play of the third quarter. First and ten play coming up. It's fucking crazy. Nah, I really it was like. He was like four years consecutive. Motherfucking, uh, what's their first name? Auburn. Shit. The and niggas was goddamn in the Birmingham Bowl four years in a row. They, and they couldn't even sell out the tickets. <laughs> they started giving them motherfuckers out. Right now, nigga. I'm surprised. The sure hands. <laughs> oh, the ball to the ground. The ball bounces that's out of bounds. That's and the offense will hold on. Nigga, that's because I tried to hurdle. Oh, that's because I tried to Not going to lie. That's that's you should have lost. I tried to hurdle. Oh, damn, if that was me and Faith. I don't. And the defense has recovered. I don't. Still on feet. Feet on land. We face feet on land. Hum! Makes a quick catch. Zero running room. Stop right at the line of scrimmage. What do you say? You don't motherfucking win. So what? Uh, we did. Uh, so what? Uh, we small we. We just having fun. We don't care who see. Looking to throw it again. The pocket breaking down. The junior able to bring him down quickly. The offense has been moving backwards here. Now a long way to go on the third. Living young, getting well, and free. Dropping back, it's Wilson. He's moving out of the pocket. The defense closes in quickly to stop him short of the goal line. Oh my gosh, Chris, I thought he was going to be able to find a way to get to the end zone. He is such a threat when he takes off. He pulls that ball down and tries to get to the end zone on these scrambles. But the defense just keeps him out of the goal line. That is so ass. Oh, in short. What a fourth down play, and they will take over on down. 
<laughs> Bruh, another fucking like, Georgia fan got arrested for the game, bro. Them niggas just can't. <laughs> The running game to chew on this clock now. Chris, you know, the sweat era over the years has always flown offensively. I've been always impressed with defenses that really build their defense. Bitch, you better not ever say nobody doing the same thing. Exactly what we saw right there. Second down after that run on the previous play. Here's the snap. Quarterback looking to throw. That's the fucking pick. Incomplete. There was a lot of contact. No penalty brings up third down. Chris, I thought he had his hands on that football. I thought he was going to come down with it. But give the defense all the credit with a big hit to knock that ball loose. After the second down incompletion, <laughs> big South ass crazy. Third down and eight. Drop him back. We're going to throw for the first down. Nah, that's that's a big problem for me right now for my team. I'm talking about I can dot that bitch up so goddamn nice like girl, you are a double point and you ain't gonna play in the fourth. You are way good. Smart play would have been to keep running the football, work the clock, force them to use their timeouts. Now fourth down and tough decision here. I think you gotta run it away. Nigga really would have probably scored. He's on to boot it away now. And the return man decides. Ah, he hit me, cuz. Come on, bro. That's the exit to the yards. First down here for this offense. Look at how far here to start the drive. Makes the grab. It's Tucker. And the ball can tackle there. Oh, dear. This is a solid game. The completion and sets up a second down play. Cool, 45 to the Tackle is made at the eight yard line. It'll be first and goal right there. Now to the park after the It's the marijuana worm. I ain't playing on the thing. I'm just gonna get a dirty rap song. Now we hear them on the chain chain song. So and here's the return from inside the five. Tackle at the 22. Good job by the coverage team. A little ride of mechanic and then uh, that and we got the cool cup. Here comes the Red Wolves offense back here. They're coming off a three and out. Oh, that's a real fucking out for a And they'll give it to the back. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. Turn white. And now it's the defense that calls time out here. <laughs> trying to get organized and preserve as much as possible. Looking like a zebra. That's a second and long. Send the back in motion. In a Chevrolet. Here comes a jet sweep. Two by four. Oh, oh goddamn! They just kind of stayed in place, and it gave the receiver plenty of room there to make a nice play. And that's the two-minute warning as this offense tries to work the clock, getting closer now. Five to zero. Fresh set it down. First and ten. Mm-hmm. Oh, here we go. And it's incomplete. Bro, that's a fucking fumble, bitch. With the options to try to complete the quarterback here. It's very, very unfortunate. Bro, this game is ass. I think that's a fumble, bro. He hands it to the back. 
They try the middle, but gain nothing on that one. Oh, that nigga from that motherfucking G, that bitch. Holding their own at the line of scrimmage, and then making and it's 93. Damn, that shit four dollars a fucking gallon. GG, nigga, that's what my Cadillac take with 93. GG, some confusion like on the snap out, count. A false start, damn, five man. Yards. Pretty easy. It's like it's like three, so it's like three something. That damn, that's actually pretty good for like a uh, for like Texas and shit. I know down here the gas went down. That shit like I think for like regular, that shit like two sixty something. And then for like ninety three, that shit like that. Yeah. Uh, this is like three thirty. I mean, it's hot enough, man. <laughs> that should be going up and down though. Shit, that, that damn regular need to drop to a dollar. <laughs> That's what you need to do. I was still up, bro. Look him out throwing here to start the drive. Running out of time in the pocket. Damn. Junior steps up and makes an impact play. The niggas can't block, Z. Looking like Shadur Sanders. I ain't gonna lie, Colorado. But they they look kind of high today. But, I mean, it's Colorado State, so. And there's a deep throw at the clock. Right I don't want to sound like a hey man. It's like the catch is made way downfield. That's a big game. They could have used that. There's no more game to fill it down. Hey, listen, this game is over yet. The defense can't get too comfortable with this lead. And I know the coach isn't content with giving up plays like that at any point again. Yeah, Georgia better drop from number one. Them niggas the right say side. fucking hell with them today. Not gonna lie. Bounds, churning, I told you them was playing like Bunchy. Well, this offense has a long but Georgia, way to be like, bro, I knew, I knew last year Georgia doing the right after things, Alabama be managing the clock, picking up quick yards, and getting, out of, and getting out of bounds. Some niggas is beatable, bro. I don't know why the fuck the media be making it seem like since Georgia ain't never got beaten in the season. You know what I'm saying? Them niggas can't get beat, bro. Every time Georgia has won against them, they have to pick up the ass every time. Now, it being the SEC championship, it being the SEC championship, but they don't win. So, like, I mean, I'm just saying, bro. Built the ass. And then you show, you show this week, you show this week that you going to Kentucky, like, you. You playing Kentucky to the fucking, you went to the fourth quarter with three points? Ah oh, man. Ah oh, man. Ah oh, man. You niggas are, oh, buddy. I tell you, boy. Looks like they're lining up to attempt an Beer and butter stuff. It's finna get real ugly in two weeks, boy. I'm finna get ugly as hell. Shit, one thing about it, them, them defense is like that. Bro, I'm trying to tell you. Them a defense is like that, bro. And they all line not going for that shit. You try to rush goddamn call if you want to. See, bro, I, I figured out what the fuck Georgia First down. Doing. Georgia rush four and then they they, they, they the use high low safety. And, and regardless of like I mean whether like what the, the quarterback do. But one thing Georgia can't do, bro, they, they can't guard a mobile quarterback. It's just they trip. And luckily for us, we got a fat we got the fastest fucking quarterback. In, in, in college, so hope you know that's just you know. And this nigga Jalen Monroe be putting up two and two and two, two rushing, two We're goddamn passing. Niggas a menace. Trying to create outside the pocket now. I'm gonna get like I'm gonna get like two interceptions next. The the next the 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 and the Red Bulls it's time to run the hurry two interceptions. Oh God. And some of these. First down, we're gonna throw the ball. Done. Let's it go quickly. <laughs> Can he get in? Now a timeout is taken, which is five seconds remaining. I wish I had this. This is one quarterback play that I just cannot get, bro. I gotta The Red Wolves line up with a first and goal. 
It's QB Snape. That's a nice tackle there by the senior. I gotta cut that. I'm off the mustache the now. Moment, yeah, now this nigga Cam Ward threw five touchdowns. So 45 yards, zero intercepts. I ain't gonna lie, Miami. This is like the only like actual ACC team. I know Louisville gonna try to push. It's probably gonna be them versus Louisville for the ACC championship. I feel like Miami finna dust their ass. They get one more hurdle to see if they can become the national. Only thing that leans is your. It's a dear senior. When I've been to Georgia, sipping Puga Springs in Arizona, fucking Coca Cola. If that's if your he is that, low okay, key, that's like, cool. no disrespect to that nigga, bro. I low key don't think he going you top think ten. You think you're a demon inside? If he is a senior, fuck, fuck, no. But hey, man, say he's not going top ten. Nigga, the quarterback, quarterback. Make sure y'all good folks like that. Who's talking about Cam Ward? Yes. yes. That nigga nice, boy. That nigga is nice. Probably yeah, winning hard. I mean, he, he can push for it for sure. He can push for hard. The way he balling, three points. Let me get that out. Get that out. Well, kid, here is hurt. He's 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 hurt. It's your boy Young360, man.